today let's do a video demo of my franken fretless bass <laughs> so i got the neck off of gfs okay i reshaped the headstock a little bit just to make it look different uh it's got some grover tuners nice heavy duty uh tuners on the back Ooh, 120 dollars <laughs> neck um the neck came without frets i don't know if they pulled them out or what but you know it's a little it's a little uh, jagged around the smooth uh but you can see a little tear off from the frets uh body again uh, i did modify it i made it straight through just to get a little more uh, vibration out of it i made the covers for the back panel uh, yes it is active the electronics are out of my uh, a Lackland base I had. I replaced the Lackland with a Bartolini preamp. So this is the preamp from there. So we have volume, active, uh, I think it's treble, mid, and bass. And then here's the blend. Right, oops, right now I'm in the middle. Hear a little bit of buzz there. That's kind of from the computer. I also have these Fender black wound strings. So I put a thumb rest there, a uh, brass thumb rest, and I Kind of bridge the gap there with a little piece of copper tape. Uh, if you were using not tape strings and not playing in front of a computer, the buzz wouldn't be there. So. So that's in the middle. Let's go to the precision pickup. players than me. <laughs> we go to the, this is the jazz, so we're in. That's the gist of it. Again, um, you know, it's the old little bit of noise there from the computer. Um, never play guitar in front of the computer. Um, that's pretty much it. I'm playing through uh, Gens Ben's what is that, a Neopack 3.5, so like a 200 watt, uh, with a 2x10 uh, Gens Ben's cabinet with a tweeter in it. So. I had this with me at the Berlin Guitar Swap Show a couple months ago. Almost sold it. They were, I had two people ready to buy it. One person was playing it, the other person left, and then the person playing it said, no, I don't really have the money. I'm like, dang it, I could have sold it then. So 100 bucks, uh, well worth it. I mean, even at the 100 bucks, whether you keep it as a bass or not, you have a Lacklin uh, Skyline Active Preamp. I'm um, pretty sure these are quarter pounders, Seymour Duncans, you got a Jazz, you got some nice Grover tuners, you got a Bridge, you got Ferrells, you know, you got a, just in parts alone it's worth it. So, thanks very much for watching, good luck, let me know. Uh, I'm in Norwich, but willing to travel. Cheers! Happy 4th of July. <laughs>